Okay guys, two hours today, we're going in road. Looking to take African cycling to a whole new level. This group, in short, is the future of cycling on the continent. And among this lot are riders from Rwanda, Tanzania and Namibia. They're all operating out of the World Cycling Center Africa that is based in the sleepy South African town of Potterstrom, some 120 kilometers outside of Johannesburg. In 2005, we decided more Africans need to be at, represented at the Olympic Games, at the World Championships, at a higher level of cycling. And we decided let's do something about it. Let's change Africa. Let's start small and take baby steps and see where it leads to. More than 200 African cyclists have attended camps here, but funding and sponsorship remains an issue. The money to run this operation is minimal when compared to other cycling nations, but the centre has already opened doors that were previously closed to Africa's cyclists. I want my talent to go further from where I am now, so I have to work hard to get really in the good level because I can race wherever in the world if I'm good. This is Adrian Nian Shuti. He was the flag bearer for Rwanda at the London Olympics last year. He's been attending camps here since 2008, and he's seen for himself how the level of African cycling has improved over the last five years. They come here and they win the race, they show they can do something and they change a lot of history in cycling. I think they very important to have this center and to to develop more cyclists in Africa. Although this development team can already point to some genuine successes, the key for them is long-term sustainability. Achieve that and organizers are confident that the Olympic medals and top tour podium finishes will follow. And I think Africans have the talent. If we have the resources, if we have the funding, if we have uh, the passionate people that believe in what we can achieve, the sky's the limit. That's quite a boast, given the sport in Africa comes from a low base. But perhaps some of these athletes will be among a new order in world cycling. Dan Williams, CCTV, Potterstrom, South Africa.